and meet yourself and just taking a deep breath. And feeling the expression and container of our words and our bodies. Giving yourself the space to make the movements you want to make, make the sounds you want to make. Maybe just allowing your arms to open. Taking deep breaths. As we're starting to dance and swim in the auric field that is you, that contains all of you. This auric field is as well timeless. It contains you from birth in this life, this time frame continuum, your inner child, teenage years, early adulthood. As if dancing and moving your arms and legs and hips and just feeling the space. As if dancing in your aura with your aura. <sighs> Let this be a dance of movement of deep inner standing. The inner standing that you are a powerful paradoxical being. that the world has told for century doesn't make sense. And it, it, it is sense. It's the very nature of it is sensical. <sighs> what movements, what sounds remind yourselves that the paradoxical nature of you is the very sense of this universe. And it's completely welcome here. <sighs> Feeling your feet rooted in the earth and this way, feeling your whole, all the layers of your, your whole orc feel a part of this earth. And feeling the energy of her rise through your feet, your many roots, the expansive tree system that you are. Moving gently, perhaps swaying, or moving wildly, just as an expression of this energy being integrated into your body, being welcomed into your body and your bodies. Physicalized expression of being earth, being earth in energy. Waking up yourselves to that knowing. As the energy rises through your body, perhaps you're with it in a slow sense or with it in a much faster pace, the wilder pace, just letting it flow and coming into your heart space. The heart being the conduit of this 
a chemical engine you are that can really hold the energy of everything. It is the center of the paradox within our bodies. And feeling how this heart center is connected with our root, our sacral, our solar plexus, feeling how we're an, we are an experience of an embodied Holy Trinity at every moment. Nothing exists in isolation. We aren't all heart, we're also sex, and we're also power, and we're also expression, and we're sight, and we're a cosmic mind. And then they're all expressions of deep, sacred love. Other the movements and the sounds that physicalize that and knowing for you. As the energy rises further, it meets the crown and opens to this cosmic energy, feeling the toriel portal field that perhaps looks uh, white and golden yellow coming from source through the realms of sacred geometry and entering your field and as if basking your whole field in God light and God love, the exuberant ecstatic joy that is you. Ah. Feeling your cosmic cells drinking and calibrating to these energies, having your movements physicalize them. So the remembrance of your divine nature moves more and more into the wholeness of your physical body and, and from and out through your auric fields. Ah. Ah. Taking a deep breath and if it feels appropriate and present for you, just allowing the movements to slow down and coming to stillness. And if not, you can continue moving, but just taking a moment if it feels right to feel the electric currents, the subtle movements inside of the cells and ecstatic vibration to this energy. Feeling how your subtle energies are moving and exuberant and passionate and alive, even when your outwardly physical body has calmed. This is the feeling of integration. This is the feeling of change. In any present moment, your arms can flap and open and your voice can express a loud sound and then coming back to the silence. And that is the ebb and flow of our DNA, out and in, up and down. This is the expression of life. 
and it's constantly happening within us. The more we trust in that embodied presence, the more we trust the full expression of our beinghood, of our humanity, of our femininity, and our masculinity. That who we are is every changing in every present moment, and that is an expression of divine perfection.